Okay, welcome back. You're watching 726 Mountain Home, and we are here with Ed Alexander and uh, Tammy Pope from the Arkansas Craft Guild to talk about Folk Festival, not Fall Festival, as I said <laughs> earlier. Thanks for being here, guys. Well, you're welcome. Thanks, thanks. for inviting us. Yeah, tell, us a little, us, yeah. tell us a little bit about what's going on with the um, Craft Guild. Well, the Arkansas Craft Guild uh, represents uh, nearly 100 artists that reside in the state of Arkansas. And over the, the course of the year, we've uh, sponsored several events in which these artists can display and, and sell their wares. And the first one up for us is, is coming up the 20th and 21st of April is Arkansas uh, Mountain View Folk Fest. Mm -hmm. And it's a very old festival, been going yeah, for years yeah. and years. Um, and uh, we, we sponsor a juried craft show that will be just behind the square. Uh, we have 20 artists that are that are represented. There will be glass bead makers. There's woodworking. There's an excellent knife maker. Wooden Wo bowls. Wooden bowls. Yeah. Do you have pottery? Do you have categories that I, they they compete in? Or it's or? not a competition. Yeah. Okay. They, we do have categories, and people are juried in by the category of the medium that they produce. Mm -hmm. And so I myself am in the bath and body category, and I do goat's milk soap, lotion, okay. and beeswax products. Mm -hmm. And then we have people that are in the leather category or the woodworking category or the mm -hmm. pottery. And so we have quite a wide variety of categories that are there and quite a wide variety of artisans represented. Mm -hmm. Each show is different. So if you've been to Folk Fest before, you've been to Bean Fest before, each one has different artisans. Some of your favorites will be there, and there will be new people there. It's always a different show. So it doesn't matter which one you come to. Mm -hmm. You're bound to see something new and something interesting mm -hmm. that you will like. Are they, are they all local uh, artists, or do they come from across the state? Or? They, they come from across the state. Um, in fact, in this one, we have a, an artist from Colorado that will be there with uh, pottery and, and photography as well. Mm -hmm. so. And in addition, while you're there in Mountain View, we have the Arkansas Craft Guild Gallery, which uh, houses a lot of artwork from all the, uh, most of the members of the Craft Guild. And in addition to the show that's going on, there will be a featured artist named John Kirkpatrick, and he is a wood turner. Uh, we'll talk about how his process and how he makes his art, what his inspiration is, uh, maybe even demonstrate mm -hmm. some, of, some of what he does. So if you're there for the festival and you find yourself with a little time, you can walk a half block down Main Street. Mm -hmm and find the craft guild, uh, see some wonderful art, and, and see a demonstration of a fine artist as well. Now, when is the Folk Festival happening? It is next weekend on Friday and Saturday, which I believe is the 20th and the 21st. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The hours on Friday are 11 to 6, and the hours on Saturday are 9 to 4. And we are located behind the white picket fence, right behind the courthouse. You will see our tents. When you view the courthouse, you can see our tents behind mm -hmm. there. And the artisans that are there, everything they have, they make themselves. There is nothing that is not made by the artisan. And most of it is from Arkansas, but we do invite guests that have juried in from other areas to be there. And so it's a wonderful opportunity to take your family and see some of the things that you just don't see on mm -hmm. your day-to-day travels and in your day-to-day -day shops. Now is this in conjunction with the music festival or the folk festival that's it is. going on? Yes. So it is. Right. Can you, exactly. do, do you know any information about that festival too? Um, to well, give people <laughs> an, a, a, a more incentive to want to come. Well, the, the, the folk festival has been going for, like I said, for many, many years. Yeah. And there's a schedule of events uh, on the courthouse square, but in addition to that, and maybe even uh, uh, more attractive, I won't say more attractive, but certainly attractive is the spontaneous music that yeah. breaks Absolutely. out. It, 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 yeah. it truly yeah. does. Yeah, it, People it just wow. yeah. set up. It gets infectious for a while. It does. Yes. And yeah. they're exactly. walking with their yeah. chairs and their cases, and they'll set up mm -hmm. all over town, and you will have little groups of people performing mm -hmm. all across yeah. Mountain View area. Yeah, that's interesting. It's, and, it, and it's such a tradition. I mean, that tradition of gathering on, on a a Friday or a Saturday night and playing together goes back literally for centuries. Yeah. And it, it's such a wonderful thing. And they sit, they sit not as in a concert formation, but sit in a circle and, a, and the musicians mm -hmm. address each other. Mm -hmm. So you can follow a, a, a schedule of events that will occur on the courthouse square, 
but all around town you'll find some spontaneous music that's that's really quite enjoyable as well. And that starts next Friday and next Friday and Friday Saturday. And Saturday right. Yes, 21st, and now 20th, 20th and 21st. 20th and 21st. Yeah, okay. And once we close in the evening, there's still a lot of music that oh, will yeah. be happening okay. in town sure. well into the dark hours. Uh, I just want to let people know this is a free event. Uh, yes. To come and yes, enjoy. Yes, it is. And, right. and uh, I, I'm sure the artisans uh, have items that they do sell yes. there. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. And that's you don't restrict them from doing that no oh, no <laughs> no not at all that's kind of the point of yeah. the deal is to generate so a little revenue yeah. bring yeah. some money bring some money you don't have to pay yeah. to get in no but and we do sure. take credit cards most of us okay. so you don't even have to bring real right. money you can bring plastic so it sounds like a really good fun weekend not only for the artisans but also for people that want to come and and listen to some some uh, native music yes. Uh, yes. from the area Definitely. yes Definitely. and enjoy themselves well it's a, it's a family event yeah too. I mean it's it, you'll see children of all ages as they say it at, yeah. at Every, you truly everything. do. Yeah. You truly do. Yeah. And it's a lot yeah. of fun. Yeah. I would I would caution you that uh, parking can be an issue sometimes. Okay. That would be my um, yes. And and I would suggest that you park at the folks center and they will run a shuttle back and forth. Oh, door. so they do have a shuttle. They do okay. have a shuttle. Yeah. Good. Because okay. the the parking in town is not overly plentiful. Okay. Do you, do you have businesses that rope off their businesses for that? You know, some some businesses want want their business to be exclusive to their patrons, and is there any of that going on, or do, I, do you know? I do not I've recall seen seeing okay. that. Yeah. I mean, the years okay. that no I've been there, um, most of the people that come up to Mountain View understand the traffic situation yeah. mm -hmm. and understand the parking situations. And so, like Ed said, if you park mm -hmm. at the Folk Center, they'll shuttle you into town, yeah. okay. and that makes it very convenient. Sure. And mm -hmm. it, you can get in and get out a lot easier. Okay, well, that's good. They're big shuttles. You can fun. carry packages. It's all good. Very okay. It's all good. You can <laughs> okay. carry packages back to the shuttle. Just come and uh, sure. enjoy Fun yourself. Event. Absolutely. Like yeah, great. Fun event. That's uh, next week, April, 4th, April 20th and 21st down mm -hmm. in, in Mountain View, Arkansas. Yes, it is. Come and enjoy. There's all music and, and local artisans all the way from Colorado. Sure. Yes. Yeah. So um, yeah. come down and check all that out. And. Uh, Thank y'all for being here. Appreciate well, thanks it. for well, having us. Thanks have for a having us. Have a safe trip back. We will. we will. We will. Up next, uh, our final guest is the Mountain Home High School drama class, and they are a rowdy gr group, and we will I'm gonna put my <laughs> armor on when they come in here, but we're gonna, they're going to be talking about an upcoming play. So uh, stay with us. We'll be right back. Mm -hmm.